team email should uh, arrive at this screen first, first time set up. If your uh, organization is on Active Directory, if you're using Exchange and you're on Active Directory, this field may very well be filled in for you, but you can change it. What that means is anytime you want to send an email to the team, let me go ahead and put somebody on the team here. I'll put my husband on the team. I'm sure he'd appreciate that. And maybe I'll put one of my other email addresses on the team. And hit save. Now, anytime I want to send an email to the team, I just click team email, and it automatically generates that email to those email addresses. Now, I know I was saying, well, what, isn't that what we use distribution lists for? Absolutely, but you don't have to. You could do it in one click rather than the three it would take you to create the email, find the distribution list, add it to it, and then click OK. This is a single click. Now, you can have multiple team emails. You can create any kind of quick steps you like. Thank <laughs> you.